Welcome back. This is Outcast PS4 Plays Minecraft. Today we're going to continue on our World 1 on Survival Hardcore with the Vanilla Texture Pack. Um, we're going to take a break from some building. I think we're going to do an expedition. Except rather than go on an expedition to the east, like we've done twice before, I think this time we're going to go to the west. We're going to check and see what's to the west. So let's go ahead and get prepared for this. Um, this stone sword is probably worn out. We got the traveling kit. We got some torches. I think that's all we need other than a sword. Right? I don't think we need to have like a. Uh, any going away party or anything like that either. Um, you know what? Before we go, let's actually go ahead and make a map. I think that'll be a really good idea. And it says we need a compass and a bunch of paper. Compass, four iron, one redstone. Four iron. Uh, we're going to use paper. Uh, one redstone. We got and paper. Paper. So let's make sure that we get the materials that we need. So paper. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We needed eight. So there's nine. Uh, we need. I think that's what we needed, right? Let's go see. We need a compass right here. We'll make. And we need the map and we make. And there. We officially have our first crafted map. Now, the game gave us a map when we started with, but we ditched it because it wasn't fair for us to have something that we didn't craft. So we threw it away. And we have no idea really where we've been sitting on our first map. Now if you're just joining us, we're playing Minecraft uh, on the PS4. Uh, the worlds here are 36 times bigger than they were on the prior consoles. Which means that on the prior consoles, the world was only as big as this one map. But now it's 36 times bigger, which means the world is now equivalent to six maps wide by six maps up and down. And look at this. Our house is built here. This is the direction in which we... Hold on a second. That's the direction right over here of those two temples that we found <clears throat> and the, the snow biome. Our build is right over there and our bridge. But today we're going to skirt this direction. All right, so we have a map. And the way it works is as long as you're, you have it open, it will update it. If you have it closed, it will not. Um, you know, at some point, I think... There's, yeah, I took all the sand out of this river. I was working on that. Away from camera. At some point, we need to put make a, a cocoa bean farm. I have a really cool idea on how I want that to go. Um, see, we came through the jungle, so we're heading back towards our spawn location. Look at that. Some ocelots up there. Water pool. Cave. Oh, holy cow. Folks, this has been right here under our nose the entire time. Hey, look at that. Look oh, over there. I don't know if you can see that. I'm going to tilt a village. Oh, man. We had like a ready-made base and a village for food like right here. That's crazy. We didn't even know it. All right. Well, I guess we get exploring. 
Alright, so here's the other parts that you didn't see in the other temples. Up here, it's just another layer. So we're just going to throw torches. That's all that is. Yep, Tomb Raiding. It's a pretty good profession. It doesn't pay very well, but it's okay. We're not in it for the money, because we're only in it for the diamonds. All right, and we know where that's at, right? We gotta dig down right here. I'm really excited about that village. I'm like wondering, I'm hoping it has like a blacksmith. So we can grab some loot out of there. Loot is good. I enjoy loot. Um, yeah, I guess we could put one here. Why not? We can make more. Sandstone. Oh, that was sandstone. Look at me. Being a goober. Alright. Let's see what uh, the Minecraft lords has have blessed us with. Bones. Zombie rotten meat. Chests. Might as well, right? More zombie rotten meats. Two iron. Five bones. And another chest. Amen. Oh, look at that. I said amen. We got two diamond. Maybe I should say amen every time we open it. But Rotten flesh. I don't remember what rotten flesh for. I think that's for... Uh, amen. Uh, didn't work as well. Uh, I, th I think rotten flesh, we feed wolves or dogs or something like that. You can feed it to them and make them happy and... Regenerate their health? I think. I do not know for sure. Do not know. Oh, it's getting dark. Ladies and gentlemen, this is why we brought our traveling kit. Oh, let's see. Literally, yeah. That's crazy. The temple was literally right next door to us. And, and I guess, I don't know. And you guys didn't comment about uh, who might be playing this actual seed with me. And you guys are like, hey, there's a temple over there? Well, yeah. Uh, yeah. And you know what? Even if, even if you had said it, I probably would have been upset because that ruins my exploration of the world. So at least you know that you're going to explore it with me. The spoiler alert is there. But... I don't like people saying, hey, if you go to this coordinate, this coordinate, there's this or whatever. You know, that's not really cool, man. That's not fun. It's all about exploring and finding new things. You take out the exploration, and what do you got? You got creative with dying. That's not too cool. All right. So this has been done being explored. So, you know what, let's work our way along up this sandbank here. I think we're going to go over to this village. I want to see if there's anything else. Like I said, I'm pretty sure our spawn is over here somewhere. Definitely was not like right next to the sand tip, I'll tell you that. But uh, I'm going to guess that it was like right in here. How far is that through the jungle? Did we travel that far? Oh, water. Yes, I remember water. So it's got to be like right over there somewhere because I do remember it being sand, but I didn't remember looking the way of the sand because I wasn't looking for a desert. I wanted oak planks. So I never looked this way. Ooh, look. kind of looks like Wile E. Coyote looking off in that direction. Coyote Hill. 
Look at that. Or Dog Mountain. Whatever. That's pretty neat. Not sure what we got going on here. So this is sandstone. But that's pretty unique. Let's free that cactus to grow. How'll that be? And we're just gonna... Alright, so this is a desert village. As you can see, it's built out of a bunch of desert materials. Um, you know what? Uh, we are also going to be horrible masters to to these these villagers. Um, now that we've explored this, they can be attacked by uh, zombies at night because they only get these stupid wooden doors. But we're gonna lock them in and block their doors with sandstone blocks so that they'll always be here and I don't have to worry about like zombies killing them. Does that make sense to you guys? So I needed to get dark. It's probably not going to happen in this episode, but that's definitely what I'm going to do is I'm going to probably just hang out here at night and let these guys go into their little homes and then I'm just going to block them in. So, well. And I'm just going to put some torches in these things too because... Oh, look, there is a blacksmith. That's awesome. And I don't think there's anything naturally in the two things, but there is a chest in blacksmiths. So, uh, tree saplings some obsidian look at that we, we wouldn't need, need need to make an obsidian maker we had enough there's enough obsidian in here to make a gate to the nether huh 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 they're always thinking just always thinking mines are going a million miles a minute uh that's all they do is they think, 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 think. And he, he's a priest, I think. Priest offers a diamond sword, sharp aspect 2, fire aspect 1, for a diamond sword and two emeralds. It's pretty impressive, my friend. Oh, greetings. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how I'm going to block these guys in. So I'm just going to block... Oh, crap. I wanted another one in there. Man, here's another one of those uh, stunted cactus... You know what? Basically, you just go like that, man. And I go off the top one. So now those guys are trapped in there. And we'll always have villagers that we can maybe transport back. So let's finish lighting up these things. Because the last thing I want to do is lock them in rooms that are dark. <laughs> that would suck. So I think we've gone through the village and we lit up every place. So now we're just waiting for it to get dark. And let's put some torches outside. Not necessarily gonna put one here because they're not gonna take shelter in there. All right, so I think this episode is coming to a close. Basically, I'm gonna do off camera before I start the next one is just let it get dark. I am gonna block up each one of these doors to trap these villagers in their homes to be safe, so we can use them later when we want to. And then when you come back, we'll sleep, start daytime, and we'll see what else the village has to offer. Sounds like a plan. Yeah, I th think this sounds pretty cool. So, this has been Outcast PS4 Plays Minecraft. Be sure to like, subscribe, or comment if you've been enjoying the series. We'll do more. Come on back when you get a chance. Hmm. Hmm.